Hey there guys, welcome back to another video on the channel and today we're going to be doing the four championship predictions that are on this Tuesday and Wednesday due to postponements. Um, <coughs> but yeah, let's get, let's get into it. With the first game being Preston North End versus Sheffield United. And at the moment it's um it's 14th versus 15th, the same points. Um looking at the uh the last five games, Sheffield United actually lost their last game and they've stopped their run of form, which was four wins in a row, and Derby stopped it. So their form is a loss, a win, a win, a win, a win. Preston is a draw, a win, a win, a loss, a draw. So not bad from both parties. Um Sheffield United actually have a game in hand on Preston North End. So if Sheffield United win this game they could go a little bit ahead a lot, a lot ahead of Preston North End in the end. But um I am gonna back a Sheffield United win. I know they're away. I backed them last week and they lost. So that's not good of course. I'm gonna go Preston North End one Sheffield United 2. I think Sheffield United have enough quality. I know they lost to Derby County, but Derby County are a difficult team. And Derby have actually gone outside of the uh, of the relegate of last, even though that points deduction. So, you know, Derby are a really good side. And um, But yeah, so it's an unlucky loss for Sheffield United, but they'll bounce back against Preston. Moving on to Fulham versus Birmingham. And Birmingham have been on terrible form. A draw, a loss, a loss, a draw, a loss. Terrible form. And Fulham, a win, win, loss, draw, draw. But Fulham, their last two matches have been a 6-2 win and a 7-0 win. It's, oh, it's filth. And now they're against Birmingham, which could be another domination. It really could be. Um, so, I'm, I'm going to go Fulham 4. Birmingham nil. I, I just think you know Fulham in the last what two games, thirteen goals in those two games. It's not looking good for any any player, any um team coming up against them. But yeah, it's going to be a, a very good game, and I'm intrigued to see. But I think Fulham will get a dominant. Like Mitrovic is on fire, 27 goals this season. Like he's top goal scorer, and he should be by miles. But he's actually only seven goals ahead, which is pretty much a lot. But yeah, for me, um, Fulham have enough quality, don't they? Moving on to uh, Hull City versus Blackburn Rovers. Um, you know, Ful Hull City losing to Stoke City last game, which you know isn't the best for Hull but Blackburn getting a uh, getting a win against Cardiff 1-0 so that's that's a good result for um, Blackburn um, yeah Hull City look a good side of course um, you know where are they in the table they're 19th with three losses in a row and then two draws so uh, they could carry on their losses um, Blackburn could go ahead of Bournemouth but Bournemouth will have a game in hand. And Blackburn have a brilliant form. Um, a win, a draw, a win, a win, a win. So, even though Blackburn are away, I'm going to go Hull City 1, Blackburn Rovers 2. Another win for the Blackburn Rovers, and that's really good form for them. Moving on to Reading versus Luton Town. And two teams, you know, Reading should have beaten Middlesbrough. I know it's Middlesbrough, but they should have won. They conceded two late goals. Um... Seeded a 84th and a 95th minute, so two pretty much late goals is a bad loss that is from Reading. Um, but Luton just beating ball with brilliant result for Luton Town, absolutely phenomenal, and it's a close one. I'm gonna back Luton Town with a no, a draw actually, 1 1. I don't see a win in this. If there is going to be one, it'll be Luton. But yeah, 1-1 one, one for me. And that wraps up the video. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit notification bell. And see you in the next one. Bye.